Hello dear students, I welcome you again to the another edition of online class on calculus. So, so far we have learned various kinds of differentiations, first order derivatives, second order derivatives and a very small application of first order derivative that is Lagrange's mean value theorem. Okay, But in most of the book, the main chapter on application of derivatives begins with this particular topic that is rate of change of quantities. Now you have already seen rate of change of quantities in your class 11 physics as well. For example, uh, you learned about velocity, you learned about acceleration, right? So all these come under the very same topic. Okay, so we are going later on we are, when we are solving problems, you'll come across the sums which you have already seen in your class 11 physics as well, right? Okay, so let's try to understand the topic again. Now, rate of change of quantity. Now here, I'm denoting the quantity by Q. Okay, so Q stands for quantity. Okay, and let me assume that this quantity depends on something okay and that something is known as parameter okay and let me denote this parameter by letter p capital p okay now the word or the sentence rate of change of quantity is represented in this way so rate of change so dq means it is a change in quantity with respect to with respect to the parameter because this q is depending on p right so rate of change of quantity with respect to the parameter p is denoted by this okay so this is the change in quantity dq re represents the change in quantity and dp represents the change in the parameter so basically this full thing represents the change in quantity if or with respect to the change in the parameter okay so that's what we are going to learn or that's what we are going to find in the rest of the sessions of this particular topic okay now let us begin with the first problem for the day so question says find the rate of change of s okay so it is given that we need to find the rate of change of s which is given by t by square root of t plus 1 with respect to t okay now we have to find the rate of change of s with respect to t that's what the question is saying and we have to find the rate of change when t is equals to 3 okay so let's see how to find this so we have been given so given is s equals to t by square root of t plus 1 right so as for the question we need to find ds by dt because we need to find the rate of change of s with respect to t so basically the question is asking find ds by dt now for that we need to differentiate both sides right okay you have got f by g form okay now so f by g ko formula cost of seven right something in the denominator we have something square and in numerator right so let's try to avoid that and let's try to use something called logarithmic differentiation. So log log Let's try to see. Okay, so log log We have log s out here, right? Now here is log a by b. And log a by b it is log a that is a t. So log t minus log b Okay, log b is log of square root and square root like mokati pani lekhnu saksu to the power half pani ta lekhnu saksu right so we have t plus 1 out there aba euta formula cha logarithm ma which says yadi yaha nira power chha ni yo power lai cha mo ka leunu saksu agadi pati leunu saksu okay so that means if i apply log here then i'll get this particular thing right okay now let us differentiate both sides with respect to t okay so differentiating both sides with respect to t here there's some game sir so from here we have from here we have 1 by s into ds by dt now we are quite familiar with the logarithmic differentiation so let me write it this way now let me differentiate log t now differentiation of log t will be 1 by t 
and since we are differentiating with respect to t अब t लाई पनि अझ डिफरेंशिएट गरे dt by dt नै हुन्छ व्हिच विल बी इक्वल्स टु 1 सो त्यो मैले लेख्नु यहाँ परेन राइट सो माइनस हाफ इज देयर ओके अब फेरि यहाँ के छ भने लग छ सो व्हाट इज डिफरेंशिएशन अफ लग इट विल बी 1 by t plus 1 अब चेन रुलले भन्छ यसलाई पनि डिफरेंशिएट गर्थ्यो सो t plus 1 को डिफरेंशिएशन कति हुन्छ इट विल बी अलवेज 1 सो त्यो 1 पनि मैले यहाँ लेख्नु परेन ओके नाउ from here, what is ds by dt? Here they So ds by dt will be equals to. Aba yo s line le uta pati lano pare. Kika so? So yo s line le uta pati log yani kati unsa bandari? We have one by t minus one by two into t plus one. So yo ta eti ni sa right? Aba yo one by s eta onda yani kati unsa s unsa. Ani what is s? S bani kati sa amra ma we have s equals to t by square root of t plus 1. So this is the value of my ds by dt that is rate of change of s with respect to t. Now we need to check the value of this at t equals to 3. Okay so let us check the value of the very same thing at t equals to 1. So therefore ds by dt at t equals to at t equals to 3. So this will be equals to so let's see how much it becomes. So we have t that is 3 by square root of 3 plus 1 zaza t cha tyani ra mo 3 lagau desu right divided by or oh sorry into 1 by t that is 3 minus 1 by 2 into t plus 1 that is 3 plus 1 okay so yo bhane kati huncha bhanda it is 3 by okay so square root of 4 right square root of 4 kati huncha square root of 4 so there's a 2 okay so we have 1 by 3 minus 1 by kati unesa 8 unesa right okay so let us simplify this so we have 3 by 2 into okay so the LCM of these two is 24 so let us quickly simplify this so we have so these two gets cancelled right Okay, so how much is this? This will be 8 minus 3 is 5. So 5 by, okay, so 2 into 8 is 16. Okay, so that's what is my answer for this particular question. That means the rate of change of S with respect to T when T equals to 3 will be 5 by 16. Okay, let us have a look at this particular question. So the question says, the radius of a circle increases at the rate of 1 by pi. Find the rate of change of its circumference and number two area when its radius is two units. So basically you can think of a circular metal plate okay and just imagine that you are going to heat it okay. So when it is heated you know that it expands right okay. So it expands in all possible dimensions for example it will expand in radius okay. So here what is happening the radius is increasing this radius r of the circle or circular plate is increasing at the rate of 1 by pi that means radius is changing with respect to what obviously it has to be with respect to time okay so when you heat it what will happen as the time increases radius also increases okay and one more thing that i have not said till now is Whenever it is the case of increasing, then the sign has to be always plus, okay? And whenever there is a case of decreasing, then the sign will always be negative, okay? Okay, so let's get back to our work. So again, the radius is changing with respect to time, okay? So whatever the things are given, I'll, I'm going to just note it, okay? So given is dr by dt, rate of change of radius. The radius increases at this rate that means rate of change of radius is given to be how much it is given to be 1 by pi okay so unit is not given so let me write it this much itself okay so dr by dt is given to be 1 by pi now we need to find the rate of change of its circumference so let us first deal with our circumference so number one now circumference is given by 2 pi r yes or no right 
Okay, now let me denote the circumference by C. Now, according to question, what we need to find is, we need to find the rate of change of circumference. That means, C is changing with respect to, again, time. Okay, so, radius is changing with respect to time. Okay, now, when the circumference when you can change on the the time board is answer circumference when you can this answer board is answer. Okay, now, so we need to find rate of change of circumference that is BC by DT. Was this all? Okay, so that's why I'm writing differentiating both sides with respect to T. Okay, so my my answer is on the other I'll get DC by DT equals to. 2 and pi they are constant so I'll keep them outside so we have R okay so R code differentiation kati unsa derivative unsa with respect to T it will be dr by dt right okay so I'm my dr by dt ko value already sir okay na? so let us put the value dr by dt so we have 2 pi into 1 by pi right okay so yeah, yeah, pi and pi gets cancelled. So we have 2 into 1, which is equals to 2. So rate of change of circumference, it will be equals to 2 units. Okay, now let us go back to the second case, that is area. Now we know that area is given by pi r square. Circle ko area is pi r square. Okay, now let me denote this area by capital A. Think so? so question like this, find the rate of change of area. Again, just the time board is answer, kyun this answer? Plate, metal plate, kyun this answer? Thulo unde this answer? Thulo unde this answer? Okay, na? surface area board this answer. So that's why I need to find dA by dt from here. Okay, so again, you'll write differentiating with respect to t. You choose very many lekhnu pasa. I don't have space. I'm not writing that. So we have dA by dt equals to pi. Now, R square like differentiate got the hair cut in so pile at the 2 R on the right so it will first 2 R now R like any many differentiate gonna buy so R could differentiation with respect to T cut in sorry it will be dr by dt okay about my life R value pen dx at the R cut is a 2 units one this okay so therefore my d a by d t when my radius is it will be 2 is going to be here this one. So we have pi into 2 r. R one is 2. So let me write 2. Ani dr by dt one is it will be 1 by pi. So your pi and pi gets cancelled. So we have 2 into 2 into 1, which is 4. Manchi mirror answer for this particular question is going to be 4 units. Okay, let us have a look at this particular question. So question says, while a train is traveling from a rest to the next station, its distance x kilometer from start in t hours is given by x equals to 90 t square minus 45 t cube. Find its velocity and acceleration after 6 minutes. Now let's try to understand this question. So ki unde sir bandai si, maani do mea do it as station sir. From station one to another, a train is traveling. Okay, so many you may have a station, sorry, A, or co station, sorry, B. Okay, and the train say A dikhi B sama zadesa. Okay, so A dikhi B sama zadesa. Okay, and the many you, your train say you have start hunda hari from rest bande sahi. So velocity zero by initial velocity. So you have start by her, you have some pugno, your point pugno. Say time lag here, t. Okay? Ani t say kati bande sa, hours bande sa. So, t hours lag here, yo point pukno. Bani chi, yaya dekhi yaya samko distance say kati unsa, bande hai say kati unsa re, x kilometer. Kina ani yaya bande sa, x kilometer say t hours maje travel gwa sa bande sa. Bani chi, yaya dekhi yaya samaje kati here, x kilometer. Ani yo distance say, kasi find gane, kunche formula use gare find gane, bande hai say, it will be equals to kati here, 90 t squared minus 45 t cube. So you use got it as a distance hami nikalna saksa. Right. So the question is asking find the velocity. So x stands for your displacement. Right. So you need to find velocity that is dx by dt. Ani or ko acceleration. 
okay so let us try to find the velocity and acceleration after t minutes uh, i'm sorry six minutes but here this six is also time okay so time you the ring key when this time time to keep on the battery hours on the so that's why i'll convert this into hours okay so let us begin with this sum so given is t is equals to kati when t is kati sorry six minutes that I mean like you can hours my convert done but so our my convert the very good answer it will be six by 60 that is 1 by 10 hours so I have converted my time into hours now next thing given to us is we have x equals to 90 t square minus 45 t cube so this is given to me now to find the velocity I need to differentiate this that is displacement with respect to time that is t okay so differentiating both sides with respect to t so cut even say here there's all so we have dx by dt equals to so 90 t square co differentiation or derivative cut even sorry it will be 180 t right okay any t cube cut even say 3 t square so 3 into 40 by 3 5 is a 15 carried over 1 3 4 is a 12 plus 1 it even say you day and it has a good user t square answer so you say i'm gonna like you dx by dt similar to velocity okay now so let me write this velocity as v think sir so v stands for velocity okay and i'm like to keep on the sorry velocity final answer at time equals to kati 1 by 10 hours okay 1 by 10 hours so it will be equals to here this one kati answer so it will be 180 into t t one by 10 minus 135 into t square but it will be 1 by 100 right so let us do the cancellation 18 and 135 by 100 it will be 1.35 okay so you have 18 but you subtract around so this will be 18 1.35 I subtract got no body so 10 minus 5 is 5 so 9 is there so 9 minus 3 is 6 okay so yeah 17 so 17 minus this is 16 right so my answer for this particular question will be 16.65 a better unit so velocity go unit came sir but I it will be meter per second kilometer per hour I so when you know so sir the real near x came as a x is given in kilometers and your tip and I'm looking at my conversation are my money answer on this a kilometer per hour so this is my velocity but this all that okay now um, let me give some numbering takes a so number it did I say uh, let me call this is one and let me call this is two okay now I'm going to differentiate two you know any velocity like differentiate got any matter my leaky pounds acceleration pounds okay so differentiating two with respect to with respect to t nigga nobody right okay so it's called differentiation or it's called differentiation when the heavy money value okay so you can write either dv by dt or you can write d square x by dt square second order derivative okay so we have second order derivative dx d square x by dt square equals to cut even sir when i 180 minus okay so 135 t square code differentiation cut even sir 2 into 135 that is 270 t pound there is a okay now any element like it in sorry it will give me the acceleration okay now any money is a key gonna be sir acceleration okay a stands for acceleration and the acceleration at t equals to 1 by 10 so let us find how much is the acceleration when my time is 1 by 10 hours so we have 180 minus 270 into t is 1 by 10 so you do it a cut so 180 minus 27 will be equals to 153 about unit like nobody okay now so unit here the heavy math is a 
भादा खेल हर यूनिट के एक्सिलेशन को मीटर पर सेकेंड स्क्वेर हो तर हम मीटर दैट इज लेंथ को यूनिट यहाँ के दैट इज किमीटर हो कि अभी सेकेंड दैट इज टाइम को यूनिट के यहाँ आर छ हो कि सो दैट्स वाई माई यूनिट विल बी किमीटर पर आर स्क्वेर ओके सो दिस विल बी माई आंसर फर दिस पर्टिकुलर क्वेश्चन Okay, let's have a look at the question which has come in the HS examination of 2019. Here they go. So you actually think you have an objective mark with you. So the question says the rate of increase of a side of a square is one centimeter per second. Okay, so there is a square. Then you have a square. Is a any square? Co. Pratik side ni kiyum desa increase hum desa. Okay, that means one second ma se kati le increase hum desa. Banda hai se. One centimeter le increase hunde sir. Okay, question is asking the rate of increase of the area of the square when the length of one side or length of a side of the square is two centimeter. Okay, so let me write each side to be a. Okay, so each side of the square is denoted by a. So basically, yani ki dekho risa banana hai. So it is given that rate of increase of a side. That means increase of a side banana chhi a ko chhi rate. ये रेट अफ इंक्रीज अफ ए चाहे देखो रहे सो गिवन हियर इज गिवन इज डी ए बाई डी टी टाइम सी तो नहीं चेंज भैर यूनिट लेताइर के सो इट इज गिवन टू बी हाउ मच इट इज गिवन टू बी वन सेंटीमीटर पर सेकेंड ओके सो क्वेश्चन लिखे भाई सर फाइन द रेट अफ इंक्रीज अफ एरिया ओके एंड एरिया ऑफ द स्क्वेर इज गिवन बाई एरिया इज गिवन बाई हाउ मच इट इज गिवन बाई ए स्क्वेर ओके ना साइड इन टू साइड दैट इज ए स्क्वेर नाउ वी नीड टू फाइंड डी कैपिटल ए बाई डी टी ओके रेट अफ चेंज अफ एरिया सो डिफ्रेन्सिट बोथ साइड के होता डी ए बाई डी टी हो हाई सो हि इट बिकम्स पैला ए स्क्वेर डिफ्रेन्सिट गए टू ए भाई अब ए लिफ्रेन्सिट गए कैं हो इट विल बी डी ए बाई डी टी राइट ओके सो भाई सर रेट अफ चेंज अफ एरिया वेन Each side of the square is given to be how much? Each side is given to be two centimeter. That is, A is given to be two centimeter. So therefore, d A by d T, when each side that is A is given to be two centimeter. So what do you understand? That is, it will be two into A. A by what is that? Two, right? Into d A by d T is one, right? So that's why my answer for this particular question is going to be four. And the area for unit K, what do you understand? Centimeter square. पर टाइम टाइम के मैं देखो सर सेकेंड में मेरा आंसर कति होने सर फोर सेंटीमीटर स्क्वेयर पर सेकेंड सो दिस इज गोइंग टू बी बाई आंसर फॉर दिस पर्टिकुलर क्वेश्चन ओके लेट अस हैव अ लुक एट दिस क्वेश्चन अगेन दिस क्वेश्चन हैज कम इन द एग्जामिनेशन एच एस एग्जामिनेशन ऑफ टू थाउजेंड सो क्वेश्चन इज A particle moves along the parabola y square equals to 4x. So the parabola is that any particle can move around. Move around. Find the coordinates of the point on the parabola where the rate of increment of abscess. Let's try to understand the rate of increment of abscess is twice the rate of increment of ordinate. Okay. So it's like this. Actually, I'm the diagram one on one. So let's try to understand the very same question using diagram. Okay, so we have a parabola. What I do? So parabola y square equals to four x. What is it? Y square. The side. What is it? What is it? Positive. What is it? What is it? X square value. So side. What is it? What is it? I'm the positive. X square value positive. This part is what is it? Okay, na. What is it? My parabola. This part is four x. Okay, so this is my y square equals to four x. Right? Okay, so your parabola. What is it? ये पॉइंट फाइन करना अरे ओके सो मान लियो तो पॉइंट यहाँ अरे ओके इसको कोडिंग एक्स कमा वाई ओके अब यह एक्स कमा वाई लाई एक्सला हम के भाई एप्सिशा भाई वाईला हमी भर्डिनेट ओके सो एटा पार्टिकल अरे यो पारोला में मूव कर ओके सो यू नीड टू फाइन द कोडिनेट अफ अ पॉइंट सो मान लियो तो पॉइंट यो अरे ओके जिस को कोडिनेट है एक्स कमा वाई बुझे सो यहाँ के होता है रेट अफ इंक्रिमेंट अफ एप्सिश इंक्रिमेंट चेंज भाई भैया और इंक्रीज भादा खेल ओके सो एप्सिशा के इंक्रीज होते यहाँ 
okay so the rate of increase or increment of absence that is dx by something manchi x kima depend gai raksa we don't know that okay now suppose manu know dx by dt okay so the rate of change of or increment of absence that is dx by dt should be equal to twice of rate of increment of ordinate so double on basare rate of increment of ordinate that is dy by dt ko double on basa ओके ना इस हेने कुन चाहे टाइप को पारावला हो भादा इट इट इज काइंड अफ वाई स्क्वेर इक्व टू फोर एक्स ओके बुझे सर सो फर वाई स्क्वेर इक्व टू फोर एक्स लेट मी कल दिस इक्वेसन वन ओके अब इसको पारामेट्रिक इक्वेसन को बारे में तिमी सुने लास्ट इयर को कोड इन जोमेट्री बड़ ओके सो द पारामेट्रिक इक्वेसन For this is given by okay. So for uh, this, the parametric parametric equation is so. Its parametric equation. What is it? Unsa? That is, that is. I have written it last year. Co quadratic geometry book. Open it. No. Then that is my only point. Its parametric equation. What is it? X equals to a t squared and y equals to 280 okay so this will be the parametric equation of this okay now the given equation is the given parabola parabola is kati sa manai it is y square equals to 4x okay let me call this as 2 now wonder to compare gari ni a ko value kati huncha hola a ko value definitely 1 nai bhai halcha okay na so comparing comparing One and two. Comparing one and two, we have a बने कती हुई देसा one okay बने ची इसको parametric equation कती हुई देसा तेरे को so therefore parametric equation of two will be or will be now लेकिन is लेक दाहिर बनी बाय आलिया okay so we have x equals to ए टी स्क्वेर अने कति वन छो इट विल बी टी स्क्वेर ओके ठीक है इस मंदु इक्वेसन थ्री ओके एंड वाई बने कति होगा भादा टू एटी ओके सो टू ए बने वन छोटे कति होने टू टी मत होते ओके सो लेट मी कल दिस टू बी इक्वेसन फोर ओके सो मैं अगर के भन्द थे भादा वी नीड टू फाइन रेट अफ इंक्रिमेंट अफ एफ्सिशा That is dx by dt, and we need to find rate of increment of ordinate. That is dy by dt. Okay, so this is how we will find. Gonna be done. So we will find using three and four. So from three, hey, so from three, what is dx by dt? What is dx by dt? So dx by dt. When you cut it, there is a one there. It will be this two t. One three. There is a okay. So differentiation of this will be this two t. Okay, and From four, from four we have dy by dt. When you cut it, unsa, when that is, it will be equal to just two, right? Okay. Now I don't have space here. Let me erase this part. Okay. Now according to question, according to question, ki when this one that is rate of increment of abscissa. That is dx by dt will be twice of Twice of rate of increment of ordinate that is dy by dt. Okay, right? So let me put the values of dx by dt and dy by dt. So dx by dt is this 2t. Okay, and this is equal to 2 into what is dy by dt? So dy by dt is 2. Okay, means here your two right two cancel got any t co value got the i am about t co value just 2 of this. ओके बट वी नीड द कोअर्डिनेट ओके दैट इज वी नीड द वैल्यू अफ एक्स एंड वाई ओके सो द वैल्यू अफ एक्स एंड वाई कैन बी फाउंड आउट यूजिंग थ्री एंड फोर ओके सो दे फोर एक्स इज इक्व टू सो फ्रम थ्री हाई ल सो एक्स इज इक्व टू कैसे भादा खेल टी स्क्वेर राइट दैट इज टू स्क्वेर ओके विच इज फोर एंड वॉट इज वाई वाई बने कैसे इट इज टू टी सो टू इंटू टी दैट इज टू इंटू Two, which is again four. When she x co value, that is absolutely four. Is a y co value. When you cut it, is a four. Is a okay. Na? So therefore, 
द रिक्वायर्ड कोऑर्डिनेट इट इज कति हुँदै छ इट इज दिस 4,4 सो दिस विल बी द रिक्वायर्ड कोऑर्डिनेट फॉर आवर क्वेश्चन ओके लेट्स हैव लुक एट दिस क्वेश्चन अब चाहिँ तिमीहरुको क्वेश्चनको लेभल अलिकति बढ्दै जान्छ अलिकति टफ हुँदै जान्छ सो लेट्स ट्राई टु अंडरस्टैंड द क्वेश्चंस वेरी क्लियरली पे अटेंशन सो द बेस अफ ए वाटर ट्यांक इज अ स्क्वायर सो देयर इज अ वाटर ट्यांक अनि त्यो वाटर ट्यांकको डायग्राम मैले यहाँ नै बनाइदिएको छु सो वाटर ट्यांक चाहिँ कस्तो छ रे भन्दा चाहिँ इट इज यसको बेस चाहिँ कस्तो छ रे बेस चाहिँ स्क्वायर छ भनेपछि यो चाहिँ हाम्रो बेस भयो सो यो चाहिँ कस्तो रहेछ शेप इट इज स्क्वायर ओके भनेपछि इनर चाहिँ हुनु स्क्वायर हुनु पनि सक्छ रेक्टेंगल हुनु पनि सक्छ सो बेसिकली यो ट्यांकको शेप के हो यो चाहिँ के हो एउटा क्युबोइड हो ओके सो देयर इज अ क्युबोइडल ट्यांक ओके सो अनि यसको इच साइड चाहिँ कति भन्दैछ भन्दा चाहिँ यो चाहिँ छ रे थ्री फिट भनेपछि यो पनि कति छ थ्री फिट यो पनि थ्री फिट यो पनि थ्री फिट राइट फाइन्ड द रेट अफ फ्लो अफ वाटर इन द ट्यांक सो भन्छु यहाँनिर चाहिँ ट्याङ्कमा चाहिँ के हाल्नु अरे पानी हाल्नु अरे ओके सो देर इज अ ट्याप आउट हियर सो यहाँनिर एउटा ट्याप बनाइदिएँ मैले सो यहाँबाट चाहिँ पानी फ्लो भइरहेको छ ओके सो कुन चाहिँ रेटमा चाहिँ पानी फ्लो हुनुपर्छ रे विद इन द ट्याङ्क सच द्याट द वाटर लेभल राइजेस एट द रेट अफ वान फिट पर मिनट भन्नु गर्द वान मिनटमा चाहिँ यो वाटर लेभल इन द ट्याङ्क चाहिँ कतिले राइज हुनुपर्छ रे इट सुड बी इट सुड राइज बाइ वान फिट भनेर भन्दैछ हो कि होइन भन्नुको अर्थ सो यहाँनिर चाहिँ के हुँदैछ रे पानी हाल्नुपर्छ सो देर ह्याज टु बी सम वाटर इन साइड दिस ओके सो वा पानी हाल्नुपर्छ अनि वान मिनटमा चाहिँ यति बढ्यो भने चाहिँ यो हाइट बढ्यो भने चाहिँ यसको हाइट चाहिँ कति हुन्छ रे वान फिट ओके इन वान मिनट ओके नाउ यहाँनिर चाहिँ के आउँदैछ यो भित्र पानी आउँदैछ हो कि होइन अनि पानी केमा आउँछ भन्दाखेरि हामी मिटरमा त नाप्दैन हो कि होइन पानी केमा नाप्छ भन्दाखेरि हामी लिटरमा नाप्छ डेसी लिटर सेन्टी लिटर हो कि होइन सो बेसिकली हामी लिटरमा नापौँ डेसी मिटर डेसी लिटर सेन्टी लिटर जेमा पनि नापे पनि त्यो एक्चुअली के हो त्यो चाहिँ हाम्रो हुन्छ भोल्युम हो कि होइन बेसिकली यहाँनिर चाहिँ हामीले के फाइन्ड गर्नुपर्छ भन्दा चाहिँ फाइन द रेट अफ फ्लो अफ वाटर भन्नुको अर्थ चाहिँ फाइन द रेट अफ इन्क्रिज अफ भोल्युम पो फाइन गर्नुपर्ने रहेछ इज द्याट क्लियर ओके सो इफ दिस थिङ इज क्लियर टु यू नाउ लेट एस बिगिन ओके सो लेट एस अज्युम द्याट द हाइट हाइट अफ दिस इज एच ओके सो एच डिनोज द हाइट अफ द ट्याङ्क अल राइट ओके सो लेट मी राइट लेट एच बी द हाइट अफ द वाटर ट्याङ्क भनेपछि वाटर लेभल इन्क्रिज हुनु भनेपछि वान मिनटमा वाटर लेभल इन्क्रिज हुनु भनेपछि यो हाइट इन्क्रिज हुनु हो कि होइन भनेपछि यो रेट द्याट इज वान फिट पर मिनट भनेपछि के रहेछ इन्क्रिज इन हाइट हो कि होइन द्याट इज डिएच बाई डिटी इज गिभन टु अस ओके सो गिभन गिभन टु अस इज डिएच बाई डिटी सो इन्क्रिज इन हाइट विथ रेस्पेक्ट टु टाइम इज गिभन टु बी वान फिट पर मिनट राइट सो द्याट्स वट इज गिभन टु अस नाउ अकोर्डिङ टु क्वेश्चन वी निड टु फाइन्ड वट इज द रेट अफ फ्लो अफ वाटर द्याट मिन्स वट इज द इन्क्रिज इन भोल्युम ओके होइन सो द्याट्स वट वी निड टु फाइन्ड भनेपछि भोल्युमको फर्मुला के हुन्छ त्यो हामीले लेख्नु पऱ्यो ओके नाउ भोल्युम अफ द ट्याङ्क इज गिभन बाई सो यो के हुन्छ रे भन्दाखेरि यो एक्चुअली के हो एउटा क्युबोइड हो कि होइन सो क्युबोइडको फर्मुला के हुन्छ एल इन टु बी इन टु एच हुन्छ कि हुँदैन राइट ओके सो लेट मी राइट दिस भोल्युम अफ द ट्याङ्क बाई क्यापिटल बी एल लेन्थ भने कति छ थ्री फिट हो कि होइन सो थ्री फिट अनि बी भनेको ब्रेथ भनेको पनि कति छ थ्री फिट छ अनि हाइट चाहिँ कति छ हाइट इज डिनोटेड एज एच एच सेल भनेपछि भोल्युम भनेको कति रहेछ भोल्युम इज इक्वल्स टु नाइन एच पो रहेछ हो कि होइन अब वी निड टु फाइन्ड रेट अफ चेन्ज अफ भोल्युम हो कि होइन सो डिफ्रेन्सिएटिङ बोथ साइड्स विथ रेस्पेक्ट टु ओके सो पर मिनट भनेछ सो विथ रेस्पेक्ट टु के हुनु भनेछ टी ओके सो यता कति हुन्छ इट विल बी डिबी बाई 
dt equals to 9 dh by dt all right okay so let us put the value of dh by dt so dh by dt is given to be 1 okay now and she therefore dv by dt one equity on this 9 on there is a okay now अब हेरौ मै भोल्युम को युनिट के हुन्छ भन्दाखेरि यहाँ यो सबै फिट मा कुरा गर्छ यो पनि फिट मा छ यो पनि फिट यो पनि फिट ओके न फिट इन्टु फिट इन्टु फिट इज फिट क्यूब ओके सो दिस इज एफ टी क्यू पर टाइम टाइम के मा छ हाम्रो टाइम इज गिवन इन मिनट सो दैट्स व्हाई माय युनिट फॉर दिस इज फिट क्यूब पर मिनट ओके सो देयरफॉर रेट अफ चेंज अफ भोल्युम इज गोइंग टु बी दिस मच ओके सो देयरफॉर rate of flow of water water will be equals to kati on this 9 feet cube per minute one minute one one minute one minute 9 feet cube pani chai kya on this increases on the race so that so that's what will be the answer for this particular question again so this is your 2018 question so question like given so let's try to understand a circular ink blot grows at the rate of 2 cm square per second okay so euta table sa re mani leu tya nira maile euta water droplet or ink just maile drop kare okay so ke hunda jancha pahila euta circular euta thopa matrai huncha tyai tyo ni ke hunda jancha phaili le phaili le jancha okay na so that's what is the case out here so ink blot ke hunda sari increase hunda sari at this rate ओके भने चाहिँ 1 सेकेन्ड मा चाहिँ 2 सेमी स्क्वायर एरिया चाहिँ बढ्दै छ राइट फाइंड द रेट एट व्हिच द रेडियस इज इंक्रीजिंग आफ्टर 2 एंड 6 बाइ 11 सेकेंड्स सो वी नीड टु फाइंड द रेट अफ चेंज अफ रेडियस विथ रिस्पेक्ट टु टाइम ओके नाउ लेट आर बी द रेडियस अफ द सर्कल ओके सो लेट वी राइट लेट आर बी द radius of the circular ink blot at any instant t at any instant t listen so time t means radius kati hunchha re r hunchha re okay so therefore area will begin by pi r square okay in a circle over each area will be given by this one now let us differentiate both sides with respect to t okay so differentiating both sides with respect to t so we get da by dt out here and here and here the answer when i pi r square comes i 2r right into very r like differentiate gone pari so this is dr by dt right okay now let us put the values of the given quantities that is da by dt so what is da by dt rate of change of area kati bane sa it is 2 centimeter square or let me write just 2 out here okay so 2 centimeter square per second bane sa so let me write just 2 out here so we have got pi here into 2 r is there and dr by dt that is rate of change of radius that's what we need to find here right so we have dr by dt so 2 and 2 gets cancelled so from here we are seeing that dr by dt is equals to 1 by pi r right so you by a hamro dr by dt now one this equation lay find dr by dt that is rate of change of radius when my time is 2 and 6 by 11 3 and a key me my time when the quantity sir no, I don't have any time quantity out here, right? So that's why let me write this as equation one. Or let me write this as equation one and let me write this as equation two. Okay. Now here there's a way. So initially, yeah, right? Initially, one second my say, one second my area cut is one second my area on this two centimeters square. Okay, now so yani ra amro rate line but this key one second my say area cut you say two centimeters square on this. ओके तर मेरो मा टाइम चाहिँ कति छ यति हुँदै छ भन्छि टाइम यति हुँदा चाहिँ एरिया कति हुन्छ लेट्स ट्राई टु फाइंड आउट ओके सो एरिया व्हेन टाइम इज टाइम इज 2 एंड 6 बाइ 11 सेकेंड्स 
will be equals to okay so let's try to find how much is that okay so x second ma area eti uncha bhani aba yo ta ke bhayo zyada bhayo ni 2 and 6 by 11 bhanche zyada bhayo okay na so eti bela area ke huncha zyada hi huncha okay na 1 second ma 2 cm square hunda cha bhani tyo bhanda zyada time ma ajhi thulo bhayera jancha okay na ani tyati bela time ke huncha bhanda it will be 2 into this much second 2 into unitary method okay so 1 second ma 2 huncha bhani Eighty second mass is two into this quantity, and this quantity when you cut eleven into two twenty two plus six that is twenty eight by eleven. Okay, so this will be my area. Very our area ko formula very kio manai pi r square. Okay, I am trying to find the value of r. Please remember. Okay, so yah par kio ni sa manai say yeh desa hoy. So we have pi when you cut twenty two by seven by ali. R square when see R square in it like no pario. So 2 into 28 by 11 by L. Right? Okay, so let us find the value of R from here. So yeah, need a 2 ray open cancel the 11 on that is I. So we have R square equals to 28 into 7 by 11 into 11. And in fact, this 27 can be written as 4 into 7 as well, right? 4 into 7 because I'm going to find square root. So we have r square root of 4 into 7 by 11 by 11. Okay, so this will be my area. Okay, so let us find the value of r. So we have r square equals to 4127. Hey, hey, first you need to do this after that you will do that okay so therefore dr by or let me write from 3 from 3 or, or 4 from 2 so we have dr by dt when r is equals to 14 by 11 so let us see how much is this going to be so dr by dt that is 1 by pi bhane ko 22 by 7 into r r bhane ko 14 by 11 right so do the cancellation 7 2 yo pani 2 huncha bhane chi yo bhane ko kati huncha 1 by 4 okay na bhane chi mero rate of change kati hunda cha rate of change of radius with respect to time is going to be 1 by 4 radius ke ma cha bhanda radius is given in centimeter okay so it is in centimeter okay per Time, time money came as a second. So that's why my answer for this particular question is going to be 1 by 4 centimeter per second. Okay, let us try to understand this question. Now, this question is a bit tricky. You just need to understand the terms and terminologies out here. So, an aeroplane is lying horizontally, horizontally, this way, right? So, Aeroplane uri sare at the height of 2 by 3 kilometer from the ground. So I have drawn the situation out here, right? La? So yani ra maile bana dekho chhu. Mani liu yo a matche mero plane sare, okay? So plane se position a matcha ani yo height sani yo mero yo yo line se mero ground, okay? So this height is given to be 2 by 3 kilometer, right? Ani you say horizontally uri da hai chhe or horizontal Velocity is a fifteen kilometer per hour. Okay, so horizontal velocity is given to be fifteen kilometer per hour. Now the question is asking find the rate at which it is receding from a fixed point on the ground. So here yeah, you see this your sentence early got the tricky say. Okay, so let's try to understand what is the meaning of this. So receding is okay. So you are a fixed point, sir. Ground okay. So poilaki on sir. First aeroplane pohila mat chale ground maaki gasa. Ille yoda lamo distance cover gasa ground ma. Ani then yoki gasa ukal chaun thalsa. Okay na. So let me call this point B. So B bada chahi ukal chaun start gariya. Okay. So ukal chaun thahe esri hai esri chaun sani. Okay na. So you thani hamro blue line right. So this is called receding height. Bese sir. Mani liye from here to here is x a. Okay, so BC is X and your receding height is Y. Okay, so we need to find the rate at which it is receding from the fixed point on the ground. So, 
we need to find dy by dt because y is the receding height okay no? receding height over is you see rate might change by that that's what we need to find okay any keep on this one say receding from a fixed point on the ground which it passed over two minutes ago when she I leave the currently your position was any okay now so yeah I need to say take doing me to already here is plane okay so plane I need any it's all I need doing me to already see that you when I say point B math is okay so let me call this BC to be X okay and when she yeah the key yeah some on it I die so yeah the key I yeah I put music out you there's a two minutes like or is a okay and we are going to see what will be the distance covered horizontal distance covered within two minutes okay so that's what we are going to find in order to find the value of x as well okay so when you see any actually triangle a b c area when you cause the type of triangle it is right angled triangle okay when you see more and key use one so i can use pythagoras theorem out here okay so in triangle a b c so a b c mass c is equals to 90 degree right okay when say therefore applying Pythagoras theorem so Pythagoras theorem like even some of the hypotenuse so hypotenuse and equals is a a b that is a b squared must be equals to bunch or b c squared plus c a squared right now let us see what is our a b a b is y okay now so we have a b when you go y square is a equals to okay so what is x or bc bc when you got this x square plus c a c a when you go height okay the height is given to be 2 by 3 so 2 by 3 square square cut answer 4 by 9 answer okay so let me call this to be equation 1 all right okay now uh, let us calculate this okay let us calculate what is x now i remain you when you say q when i say distance covered okay now horizontal distance covered and you yeah the key yeah some on the time cut it you two minutes the okay now okay now so you horizontal distance of any you distance yeah the key yeah some of god is a cut it you two minutes or god equals position on the right okay any horizontal speed is given to be 15 kilometer per hour okay now so we have horizontal speed it is 15 kilometer per hour right okay so speed ko formula ki distance by time okay na? so distance by time by alley so this is equals to 15 right any distance horizontal distance kati sa x okay na? any time kati like the one i say Two minutes. Three minutes slide say only. R ma convert gonna pare. So two minutes slide mo. Two by sixty. Like this. Okay. So this is equals to fifteen. So from here, what is x? X is equals to here. This is So you two by sixty. Uta goya. So two by sixty into fifteen is there. Which is how much? It is one by two. All right. When she x one ka teri sa one by two pare isay hamara tha. Right. This and this gets cancelled, okay? Now, so four times, so two to four will be one by two. When she you one is a cut actually x when you say one by two, and what will be the unit? Unit is going to be kilometer. Was this all that? Now, next is uh, okay. So if x is this much, now let us calculate what is the value of from value of y from one. Okay, so from one we have y square is equals to uh, uh, half a square right so x square means half a square that is 1 by 4 plus 4 by 9 so let us simplify this so when you simplify this i think you will get 25 by 36 let's check it out by yourself okay so you will get 25 by 36 so from here what is the value of y so the value of y will be square root of 25 by 36 which is 5 by 6 kilometer all right so i'm like x company value by y company value by right okay now let us find the required thing that is receding at the rate at which the plane is 
receding from a fixed point okay that is dy by dt that's what we need to find so to find that we need to differentiate one okay so differentiating one keep on sir here this out so we have with respect to ti okay so we have 2y dy by dt okay na ani esko kati huncha bhanai 2x dx by dt plus s ko ta kati huncha differentiation zero bhai hale now let us put the values ab hai rai dx by dt bhane kyo x bhane horizontal distance okay na so horizontal distance ho bhane yo bhane kyo bhanai it is horizontal velocity okay na ani horizontal velocity kati cha hamro ma it is 15 okay na so from here we have 2 y okay so y bhane kati cha bhanda heri y bhane 5 by 6 so 2 into 5 by 6 dy by dt equals to so 2 into x x bhane kati cha 1 by 2 right dx by dt bhane kati cha 15 parai cha right so this and this gets cancelled right so we have uh 3 right so 5 once a 5 So five three is a fifteen, right? So is there anything left? No. So from here we see that. So I don't have much space. So let me write it a smaller one. So dy by dt from here is going to be three into three. That is nine. Okay. And my unit ki unsa la mandari? Why pani ki orda distance ho? So that's why it will be kilometer per hour. So time is in hours. So that's why my receding velocity. Okay, so receding velocity I can call it will be equal to nine kilometer per hour. Okay, dear students. So with this we close for the day, and I request you to please go through the sums which are done in your textbook. Okay, so there are various kind of sums which have been solved. Kindly have a look at them, and most of the sums in your exercise will be similar to what is done in your. solved examples okay so kindly have the reference of whatever we have learned today and the reference through your book as well with this we close for the day thank you very much